As a lady, you should not be eating plain tea. That's why I'm having a quick, quick, quick midnight snack. Midnight quick snack. Look at my snack. Quick snack over here. Just a quick, 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 chop, chop. Just a small, small appetizer with a nice fruit juice to balance it out. I'm in the DMV and my FBI agent is on to me because my entire For You page has turned into DC, Maryland, and Virginia Eats and I had to try some. Everything here is from the Union Market District. I went to five different restaurants, but I'm only going to be showing four because my family of non-content creators already ate their food before I could film it. They don't care. They don't care. They just want to eat. Then they ate it while I wasn't looking and tried to give me the empty boxes. Run well, my whole aesthetic, my whole vision, the entire vibe. Betrayal. Why did you betray me and eat? Why did you betray me and eat your food before I could film it? Because I'm not a content creator and I wanted to eat it when it was hot. I didn't want you to set up your camera, put on your makeup, do all the things before I can eat my food. So you ruined the vision. You ruined my vision and you didn't care. Ruin is a very strong word. I think my tummy is actually very happy. And you have a lot of things out here and they turned out very well. So would you rec <laughs> would you recommend <laughs> would you recommend Takaria? I absolutely would. Okay. <laughs> okay. Trying to embarrass somebody ain't embarrass me. Ain't nobody trying to embarrass you. <laughs> ain't nobody trying to embarrass you. You embarrass me. You said I ruined your video. You you ruined my vision. That's what I said. Ooh, girl. Everything out here looks beautiful. First, we're trying bund up. This is a fusion of Korean and American flavors on Taiwanese bao buns. I did the pick three. This is a bulgogi bun. It has marinated ribeye, cucumber kimchi, and gochujang chili sauce. Mmm. Oh my God, that's so good. People who wear lipstick, do you know you eat about seven pounds of lipstick in your lifetime? Interesting. Pork belly bun. This has 10 hour braised pork belly, pineapple kimchi, scallions, and cilantro lime mayo. That's very good as well. I still like the bulgogi bun better, which is interesting because I don't like beef. Last bun, spicy fried chicken bun. It's fried chicken in a gochujang glaze with scallions and slaw. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I like every single one of these buns. My favorite bun, I think, is still the bulgogi bun, but they're all good. This is definitely worth a try. Next up is pudding. I got the red beans and rice. These are slow cooked red beans with smoked turkey, beef sausage over hot rice. It looks good, doesn't it? This is a bay leaf. They ain't playing no games. If you get you a whole bay leaf, they're not playing around. This is serious business. This is very good. I taste some tomato in there. It's so good. I picked some good stuff. Mm. I also stopped by Spot of Tea. This is a hibiscus mango fruit drink with light lychee. Let me mix it around. I'm not gonna lie. Mine got a little water down because I gotta set up the camera and stuff. Let me see. Mmm, there it is. That's good. I have to give it a steer. Casualties of being a content creator. It's worth it. It's refreshing. I stopped by my mall and got a variety of pastries and this mango matcha lemonade, which is very good and used to be very pretty. It's a cold froth mango shot over fresh lemonade and it was topped with fluffy mango fruit whip. You can see I like it. I'm surprised at how much I liked it because usually to me matcha tastes like grass, but it was so pretty that I wanted to try it. I like this so much and I'm so shocked by that. Let's get to our pastries. This is a key lime croissant cube. We have got to cut this open because I want to see what the inside looks like. We've got the croissant cube, the key lime pie filling and some toasted meringue topping. I'm not going to bite this whole thing. I'm a lady, like be for real. The croissant is nice. It's flaky, it's buttery. However, I love citrus. The key lime pie filling, it's very tasty. It could be a tad bit sweeter and I wish there was more throughout the croissant. Croissant. I wish there was more throughout the croissant. Croissant. This is a strawberry and cream beach ball. 
It's a croissant dough bun with red striped layers filled with vanilla cream and strawberry jam. You already know I gotta see inside this. Uh, no, why you falling? Come on now, don't do all that. Don't do that. Don't, don't act like that. Chill, chill. Okay, here. <laughs> it's not as full as we would have hoped for. Okay, let's taste it. Let's make sure we get some cream and strawberry jam. Mm, it's okay. Again, the croissant, the croissant is very flaky, very buttery. It's just an issue of um, the filling. They're not overly sweet, which I don't like super sweet things, but I could use a bit more sweetness and I would have loved some more jam at least. Like, mm, where's the jam? And the last thing I got was a blueberry thyme and goat cheese scone. Honorable mention goes to Taco Ran. That's what my family had. I wanted to show it to you, but they ate it. Let's try our scone. Well, that's pretty. This filling looks a lot more satisfying than the croissant fillings of the pastries. This is my favorite pastry. The blueberry thyme and goat cheese scone is very good. Recommend. You definitely have to try Bund Up. Bulgogi is my favorite. Mm-hmm. And Puddin's red beans and rice is on point. Mm. Mm. I'm very happy with my choices. The Union Market District did not disappoint.